All right, so in this short video, I'm going to show you another method that I use to make money on Craigslist. It's called resume building, right? Resume building. I'll type it out right here. Resume building. And this is where I go through people's resumes and I send them an email and I let them know, hey, if you're still open to working from home, here's my website. Take a look and call me when you're done. So I send them an email just like that. So I'm in Atlanta, Georgia. I'm going to go to resumes. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then these are all the current resumes that were listed. And it's listed for most recent all the way back. I think going back 30 days. So today would be July 28th. So these are all the people looking for a job. Now, what I like to do is I consolidate this list. Here's one. I need a legit job. I'm a 23-year-old young female looking for a legit job, preferably in the medical field. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. So with Craigslist, it's a hit or miss because most people are trained to look for a nine to five. Very few are open to the idea of working from home. Uh, those who at least post their resume. So what I like to do is I consolidate this list. I come up here in the search bar and I type work from home as the keyword work from home. So that will pull up any resume that has the word or keyword phrase work from home in it. So when I click search, it's going to pull up all the recent resumes that are interested in working from home. Now, it's not a perfect tool, but it will help me bite down that list a lot shorter to where I focus on people who are just interested in the work from home opportunities. So when I did that and hit search, this was uh, what I came up with July 27th, looking for work from home opportunity. This one says, I'm looking for a work from home opportunity. I have a fully functioning office in a professional building complete with conference room, kitchen, and bathroom facilities. I don't want to hear from people who want me to buy stuff and ship it to client overseas. I'm not looking for something where I have to pay anything to join. I'm not interested in mystery shopping, blah, 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 blah. So a lot of these people, they outline what they're looking for, what they're not looking for. And a lot of the skepticism that you may get are people who are not looking for scams. We're not a scam. We know that. So it doesn't make us feel bad in any way to go ahead and reach out to this person so what you do is you left click reply and then these are the different webmail links that you can uh send them an email now i use gmail regularly so i'm just going to open up gmail and what i'll do is i'll reply to that person's um resume and i would say something like hello my name is so and so let's say keith johnson um I have an opportunity that is worth your time looking at. Go here. And then I would do the equal sign, equal sign, and then the brackets. And then I would, put, uh, you know, give them my link, right? And if you want to make a link clickable, what you'll do is you'll just cop, um, copy that link. Take your uh, mouse cursor and come down here and click on uh, this uh, icon right here that says insert link. And what it'll do is it'll turn it blue, which means it's clickable. So they don't have to type it in manually. All they do is just click on it and it'll take them to directly to your page. So I would do send. Now, what I could have did was I could have just copied that entire message and go through and I would message about 20 people. 20 to 30 people per day uh picker doing work from home what is that i'm a picker working from home okay not that one all right uh work from home clerical editing proofreading book bookkeeping i just do the same thing hit gmail send them a message um now i'm gonna show you a quicker way that you can do this uh you're gonna create something called a canned message i'm gonna show you what that is so in your Gmail, if you're using Gmail, come over here to where you see the gear icon where settings, click settings, go down to settings right here. You're going to come over here to advanced right here where my cursor is. You're going to click advanced. And then where it says canned response templates, it's going to be on disabled. You need to make sure it is on enabled. And then I'm going to show you why I love canned responses. You're going to type in, uh, well, who you're sending it to. I'm going to send this to myself. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to type in 
the subject line, I would put work from home application. And I may put the year 2019, something like that. And then I would begin to type out my message. My name is Keith Johnson. I have an opportunity for you that can allow you to, number one, work online, choose your own hours, and earn daily pay. Go here, and then I would put my link. And remember, to make the link clickable, I would just come down here to this insert link icon, control K, if you will, and it turns it clickable. Now, uh, once you turn on the can responses and you enable it, you're going to see these three dots right here next to the trash can. You're going to click that. And it's going to say canned response up here. You're going to hover your mouse over can response. And then you're going to come down to where it says save draft as template. So we're going to save this, right? So I'm going to hit save, draft this template, and save as new template. So I'm going to come over here to where it says save as new template. And it's going to be the subject line. It will say work from home application 2019. I'm going to save it. So what that means is anytime I come to, uh, you know, uh, a person's resume and I want to reply to their resume, I can just uh, do a shortcut rather than me type it manually or copy and paste it. I'm going to show an example of this. So I'm not going to go to Atlanta. I'm going to go to another city. Let's go to Austin, Texas. We're in Austin, Texas on Craigslist. We're going to go to resumes. We're going to come up here to where it says search resumes. We're going to type work from home. Search. And we're going to find an appropriate resume. I am slamming with requests from my clients for more hours. I have five clients I work a few hours for as I can get away with. Three of them recently going to go full time. Home health home health aid work no service okay so that would not work uh let's see work at home gigs side gigs cleaning overnight gigs i am a stay-at-home mom of three look for opportunities to make some money for the family i've been out of work for quite a while but i'm a quick learner um blah 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 so i'm gonna hit reply to this one i'm gonna hit gmail and it's gonna open up for me to go ahead and type in um you know a response so instead of typing it out I'm just gonna come down here to the three circles it can response and the one the save responses that I have appear here and I have three right here this is the one that I just saved as a brand new one so I'll click that right there Uh oh nope all right so that's not the one I want let me do this again can response uh, this one right here at the top, work from home application. All right, this is the one that I, so what uh, what I did was, again, I came down here, can responses, and this one was the one right here that I saved. So it plugs it right in, and then now I can just hit send, and then I'm good to go. You see what I'm saying? I'll do that again. Uh, let me do it with someone else. Uh, I do freelance writing, online marketing, SEO, and more. I've been doing freelance work for around 15 years. I prefer to work from home. I've experienced okay. All right. So I'm going to, so this person is comfortable using the internet. So I'm going to hit reply. This person has a phone number. So I occasionally will give them a call or text. And when I call them, it's unscripted. It's just very pleasant, very warm. I'll say, hi, Lisa. I see you have an ad on Craigslist, your resume. I have a link for you to take a look at. I'd love to send it to you, and if you are interested, just call me back later today. And I would keep it short. I do not explain anything. I don't tell them if there's an investment. I don't tell them what the pay potential is. I just keep it very short. I invite them to take a look at my link, and I tell them I'll email them. So I recommend you to call or text just to have a more personal relationship with the uh, applicant. Um, but this case, I'm just going to email them again. I'm going to hit Gmail. It's going to open up Gmail. And I'm going to come down here where the three vertical circles are. I'm going to go to can response. I'm going to hit work from home application. And then I'm going to go ahead and hit send. So I would do about 20 to 30 of these a day. 
and then I'm gonna show you in the advanced training videos later in the year I will show you how you can hire a virtual assistant for very very cheap to go ahead and do this part for you so therefore you can uh, focus more on other activities all right so we're gonna go ahead and end the video here this is called resume building I've shown you how to send a direct response to them via phone call or email and I've shown you how to set up a canned response through Gmail and how to have a shorter way of going through all these uh, messages so with that being said thank you for watching this video stay tuned for the next video